The world of Barbie is filled with a ton of colorful characters. You've got Barbie, Ken, another Barbie, another Barbie, another Ken. Oh, look at that, a group of Kens. And then there's Alan. In the film, the narrator states that there is only one Alan, and it does spark some curiosity as to the reason behind it. Well, the actual Alan doll has a rather brief yet interesting history. He was created and introduced back in 1964 and was meant to serve as Ken's best friend as there hadn't been one before. This, of course, led to a lot of people questioning the type of closeness that Alan and Ken shared. The introduction of Alan did raise some eyebrows and just a few years after the doll was discontinued. Luckily, this was not the end of Alan's eventful life as he was revived in the 1990s. However, instead of his previous role as Ken's best friend, he was reintroduced as Midge's other half. The couple were a package deal, and they were sold in a happy family collection later on down the road. When the Midge doll got backlash because people didn't seem to like seeing a pregnant Barbie doll, both she and Alan were kept on the down low. Midge was then discontinued because of her being pregnant. Alan can be seen throughout the years, and according to E.T., he was part of the 50th anniversary special set in 2014. There are a lot of discontinued Barbie dolls worth noting, but Alan is certainly something else. In the movie, Alan barely interacts with Gosling's Ken, despite the two of them being best friends as dolls. Alan is just kind of there. He was just there with no real purpose than to be a funny little character who is uniquely charming and sort of a friend to everyone. But that's more than enough. After all, everybody loves Alan. <laughs>